Hello everyone, welcome back to Amin Mesh Club. I hope you are doing well. Today we have a nice radical problem that is square root of a times square root of a times square root of a is equal to 128. Here we have to find the value of a. Now we have two different methods. So according to first method, that is our method number one. So our problem is a times square root of a times square root of a whole square root that is equal to 128. Now if we take square on both hand side, so here taking square on both sides, then we see that this square is cancelled out with square root. So we will get a times square root of a times square root of a is equal to 128 squared so now if we take square again on both sides then we will get here it a has the squared so a squared times this square is cancelled out with the square root so we will get a times square root of a which is equal to here uh, we can use exponential property if we have a to the power m whole to the power n it is equal to a to the power m times n so here 128 2 times 2 is 4 now again taking square on both sides then here this a squared times this squared and this a squared so we get square root of a whole squared that is equal to 128 4 times 2 is 8 now this a squared whole squared will be a to the power 4 times a squared times this square is cancelled out with square root we get a is equal to 128 whole to the power at now on left hand side we can use exponential property if we have a to the power m times a to the power n is equal to a to the power m plus n now it will be a to the power 4 plus 2 and here we have 1 so plus 1 is equal to 128 as we know that 128 is actually equal to 2 to the power 7 so here we put 2 to the power 7 whole to the power 8 now a is equal to a to the power 4 plus 2 is 6 plus 1 is 7 so a to the power 7 is equal to here we have 2 to the power 7 whole to the power 8 now as we have to find the value of a not a to the power 7 so we are going to just take 1 over 7 in powers on both sides so a to the power 7 whole to the power 1 over 7 is equal to 2 to the power 7 and that is 2 to the power 7 and whole to the power 8 then whole to the power 1 over 7 now here we get now a to the power this 7 is cancelled out with 7 we get a that is equal to here we have 2 to the power 7 times this a times 1 is 8 over 7 so a is equal to cancelling 7 with 7 we get 2 to the power 8 so here a is equal to 2 to the power 8 is equal to 256 now it is the value of a from method 1 now we are going to solve the same problem by method 2 now according to second method our problem is square root of a times square root of a times square root of a is equal to 128 here we notice that this a has one square root so we just write a to the power square root of this uh, square root times this a has under two square root one and this one so we just write a square root of a 
of square root have two square roots now this a is under three square roots so square root of square root and then square root of a is equal to 128 now here this square root is actually a square root means a to the power 1 over 2 so here we have a to the power 1 over 2 times this a to the power 1 over 2 whole to the power 1 over 2 times this a to the power 1 over 2 whole to the power 1 over 2 and whole to the power 1 over 2 is equal to 128 now according to this exponential property a to the power m whole to the power n is equal to a to the power m times n so here we have a to the power 1 over 2 remains same so here we get a to the power 2 times 2 is 4 1 over 4 times a to the power 1 over here we have 2 times 2 is 4 times 2 is 8 is equal to 128 now according to this exponential property if we have a to the power m times a to the power n is equal to a to the power m plus n so our left hand side will be bases are same then powers will be added a to the power 1 over 2 plus 1 over 4 plus 1 over 8 is equal to 128 now here we have a to the power 2 4 8 taking this common multiple which is 8 so 2 times 4 is 8 4 times 1 is 4 plus 4 twos are 8 so 2 times 1 is 2 and plus 8 1 is 8 then here we have 1 is equal to 128 now a to the power 4 plus 2 is 6 plus 1 is 7 we have 7 over 8 is equal to 128 here we just write 128 now here we see that a to the power 7 over 8 is equal to 128 can also be written as 2 to the power 7 now as we have to find the value of a so taking 8 over 7 in both powers on both sides so we have a to the power 7 over 8 whole to the power 8 over 7 similarly doing the same step here 2 to the power 7 whole to the power 8 over 7 according to exponential um, property we just write a to the power 7 over 8 times 8 over 7 is equal to 2 to the power 7 times 8 over 7 now here this 7 is cancelled out with 7 8 is with 8 so a to the power 1 that is equal to 2 to the power cancelling 7 with 7 2 to the power 8 now our final step is a is equal to 2 to the power 8 is 256 so we have found the value of a similar to our method number 1 so it is our answer by using second method we get the same answer now we are going to check our both methods here step by step i hope you have really enjoyed this video so that's it for today don't forget to subscribe my channel for more interesting contents Thanks for watching. Have a nice day. Goodbye.